Hi there. Welcome back to Grammar Walkthrough. In this video, I'm going to be talking about adverbial clauses of contrast. So, without further ado, let's get started. To have a better understanding how we can use adverbial clauses of contrast, Again, I have to explain what an adverbial clause is. An adverbial clause is a complex sentence which consists of an independent clause and a dependent clause. The dependent clause functions as an adverb. That's why we call it an adverbial clause. If you don't know what independent clauses and dependent clauses are, you can watch my video about phrases, clauses, and sentences on YouTube. I have shared its link in the description below. All right, let's get back to the topic. Here we have a simple sentence. Emily still plans to compete hopelessly. As you can see, the word hopelessly is an adverb. Now we can replace it with a dependent clause. Although she's hopeless. Here, the dependent clause, although she's hopeless, functions as an adverb. Because of this, we call it an adverbial clause. But what is important here is the subordinate conjunction, although, which links the dependent clause to the independent clause. We generally use although to show contrast between two things. They can be contrasting ideas or one fact that makes the other fact surprising. For example, the dependent clause, although she's hopeless, shows the fact that Emily is hopeless. But surprisingly, in the independent clause, we can see that she wants to compete. All right, let me give you another example. Although Kate is in poor health, she continued to carry out her duties. Here, the dependent clause, although Kate is in poor health, is in contrast with the independent clause. She continued to carry out her duties. They are in contrast because when someone doesn't feel okay, they are expected to rest, not to work. Next, although Michael is 24 now, he's still like a little child. Here again, the dependent clause, although Michael is 24 now, is in contrast with the independent clause, he's still like a little child because a 24-year-old guy is an adult. So, he's expected to act like a man, not a child. Okay, you should know that there are also two other similar subordinate conjunctions that we can use instead of although. They are even though and though. Remember that the subordinate conjunctions, even though, although, and though, almost have the same meaning. Emily still plans to compete, even though she's hopeless. Even though Kate is in poor health, she continued to carry out her duties. Even though Michael is 24 now, he's still like a little child. Here I need to point out to the fact that the subordinate conjunction, though, is a little bit informal but has the same meaning as although and even though. Emily still plans to compete, though she's hopeless. Though Kate is in poor health, she continued to carry out her duties. Though Michael is 24 now, is still like a little child. All right. Sometimes it occurs that not only we want to contrast two things, but we also want to show that they are the opposite. For this reason, we can use three subordinate conjunctions interchangeably. While, whereas, and where. For example, the old system was fairly complex, while the new system is really simple. Here, the independent clause, the old system, 
was fairly complex is the opposite of the dependent clause, while the new system is really simple. The new system is actually the complete opposite of the old system in terms of complexity. Or, while others might have been satisfied, Dawson had higher ambitions. Here, the dependent clause, where others might have been satisfied, in contrast, is the opposite of the independent clause. Dawson had higher ambitions in terms of satisfaction. Or, schools in North tend to be better equipped, while those in the South are poor. Here, the dependent clause, while those in South are poor, in contrast, is the opposite of the independent clause. Schools in the North tend to be better equipped in terms of equipment. Now we can replace the subordinate conjunction, whereas, with while. The old system was fairly complex, whereas the new system is really simple. Whereas others might have been satisfied, Dawson had higher ambitions. Schools in the North tend to be better equipped, whereas those in the South are poor. And finally, we can use where instead of whereas. The old system was fairly complex, where the new system is really simple. Where others might have been satisfied, Dawson had higher ambitions. Schools in the North tend to be better equipped, where those in the South are poor. Okay, guys, that's it. That's all the things about adverbial clauses of contrast. If you enjoyed this video, please do consider subscribing to my channel if you haven't already. And you can also follow me on Instagram at Grammar Walkthrough. I'll see you guys in the next video. Till then, take care.